When considering one format over the other, it would seem logical to begin with the restrictions or lack thereof in your market. So before you even consider the event communication objectives, are there any current event audience restrictions or travel restrictions in place? What is the goal of the event? What does the program look like? Is it complex? Does it entail high collaboration? Who are your target audience? Are they local or global? What kind of a budget do you have? How much lead time do you have in the process of planning? All of these considerations and questions you ask are going to make a difference in understanding whether or not a hybrid event is the solution. Communicating effectively and engaging virtual participants as well as those in the room right in front of you will create an impactful experience in a hybrid event setting. Content is a key differentiator between a good event and a great event. Always has been. Ensure enough is done through pre-event marketing to build anticipation and to draw focused attendance to the event. During the event, audience engagement or a lack thereof can mean the difference between success and disaster. You want both audiences to connect and have a shared experience. So using interactive elements like voting or polling, chat questions, fun emojis, or even Q&A, push this engage and respond tactic. Finally, end your event strongly. It is just as important as your live event. Whether it's a live performance or a ending keynote, it will leave your hybrid audience with a lasting memory, if done correctly. First, ensure you comply with safety protocols enforced by the venue and the event organizers. Some of the basics would be temperature checks and the use of masks. On-site attendees may be limited in their ability to mingle freely or mind their proximity to fellow attendees. Your event agency will ensure safety protocols and your organization's compliance parameters are well managed, leaving you to focus on your event.